And from Acadiana, your local news leader, this is KLFY News 10 Morning Rush. The time is now 6.57. Let's get you caught up on today's top stories as you head out the door with the News 10 Morning Rush. LCG is moving forward with plans to increase the salaries for Lafayette's mayor president and other top administrators. The proposal will be presented at the next LCG meeting for final adoption. Governor John Bell Edwards will be in St. Landry Parish today. The governor will be visiting Mount Pleasant Baptist Church, which was recently rebuilt after an arsonist burnt it down. Good morning, Acadiana. This is News 10's Dawson D'Amico. A home invasion late Tuesday night turned fatal as the homeowner shot and killed one of three intruders. The two other perpetrators fled the scene and are still at large. Three members of the Southern University marching band were struck and killed in a crash Tuesday evening in Natchitoches. According to state police, an 18-wheeler hit all three students while they were changing a flat tire. Good morning, Acadiana. I'm News 10's Rodrika Taylor. For the third time this week, Beauchene High School was under lockdown. The St. Landry Parish Sheriff's Office is investigating. Good morning, Acadiana. This is Zane Hogue. The daughter of the late mayor of Melville, Velma Hendricks, spoke for the first time since the accident that took the life of her mother. Sentencing for former state senator Karen Carter Peterson has been pushed back. A hearing will now take place on December 28th. And once again, we are starting off with dense fog across the majority of Acadiana. Try to be extra careful on those roads out across Acadiana until about 9 to 10 a.m. That's when the visibility will be improving for us. Near record highs back for the afternoon, 83, partly sunny and a couple spotty showers through the day. All right, talking all things this morning. Let's see, it's National Brownie Day. Yes. Uh, lots of Christmas events happening this mm -hmm. weekend. Make sure to check our website out for that. Yeah, definitely. I know you have one in Abbeville uh, happening this weekend, and Gerald will be performing. I know it's all day Saturday downtown Abbeville. Oh yeah, that's exciting. Mm -hmm. And let's see, we had a Katie and I eats today. Soul House. Yeah, so I'm gonna good. have to try it out. Not far from here. Food. Yep. All right. Well, thanks so much for joining us here on Fast Two. Have a great day. We'll see you at noon.